welcome to another episode of Muscle IQ Physical Therapy with Dr. Chris Knudsen. Today we are going to be going over a case study of a patient who came into Muscle IQ for physical therapy after a car accident. So here we are on the MuscleIQ.com website. Um, we are looking at this case study. This is another successful auto, auto accident rehab. So the case study is for a real car accident patient. Muscle IQ is the best physical therapy clinic in Orem for fixing motor vehicle accident injuries. The following is a case study of a real patient who came in for physical therapy from Orem. This patient presented to the clinic with neck pain and low back pain after a severe accident. She was experiencing severe pain, a lot of muscle weakness in her muscles, and stiffness in her joints. She was reporting severe disability in her neck and back with her daily activities. After a lot of hard work and consistent visits to Muscle IQ, she experienced a remarkable improvement that is above average. So this first box here shows um, the scores that she reported uh, at three different occasions uh, on back disability, which is the modified Oswestry score, and neck disability, which is the neck disability index score. And on September 23rd, uh, she reported 50% disability in her back and 50% disability in her neck. Um, on October 18th, she was down to 36% disability in her back and 38% disability in her neck. And on January 10th, she was at 8% disability on her back and only 14% disability on her neck. So the above graph shows that this patient had a significant uh, Im improvement. This next graphic uh, shows us the predicted neck disability index scores for patients that come into um, uh, emergency rooms after a car accident. And uh, the graph shows the average recovery from whiplash after an accident. The worse the disability rating is initially, the harder it is to reach a full recovery. Most people see only a 10 to 15 percent improvement in function. This patient started out with a 50% disability score, and as per this graph, would have, ex and it would have an expected recovery to about 35% disability after 12 months. Instead, by coming to Muscle IQ, she saw a reduction to just 14% disability. Here we see uh, a graphic showing the improvement with her range of motion, or her mobility. The first score uh, comes from September 24th in the black line here. Then you have um, from October 18th the brown line showing the scores here for range of motion. And on January 10th the range of motion in blue showing that she made a full recovery with range of motion. Here we have uh, her strength scores. From the same test days, black being the first test, uh, brown being the second test, and blue being the third test at the end of her therapy. This shows a su significant improvement. Now if we want to just look at the straight numbers for this patient, um, these reports are printed off for every patient that comes into physical therapy at Muscle IQ. Her neck scores and her back scores for strength and how much uh, force she was able to push with in each direction. So the three graphs above show the improvements with this patient made in range of motion and muscle strength from September 24th through January 10th. Neck extension strength went from being 64% below normal to just to 27% above normal. Back extension strength improved by 202%. This is what sets Muscle IQ apart from other physical therapy clinics. We can give you reports that show your progress every step of the way and we will keep working with you until you reach a full recovery.